I'm a qualified chiropractor and a remedial master too. And uh, I've been doing this work for almost 60 years. And um, and since I've been using the Pulsar, which is, I'd say it's between eight and nine years, I've had some amazing results that you can't get just through chiropractic work and, and massage work. You have to have something else to uh, to, to advance um, those, those problems. And um, I feel without magnetic field um, that I wouldn't have the results that I get. And uh, so it's, 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 it's quite amazing. But um, there'd be hundreds of testimonials I would have. And, um, but I'm just going to talk about uh, a couple of significant ones today. Um, some people from Sydney had this dash hound um, whose back uh, went on us. She went and took us to the local vet. Um, he said the dog needed surgery. Um, so she went for a second opinion, took her to Sydney University. They, they was of the same opinion, said it would cost $1,500 for the uh, for the X-ray for the scan, and um, three and a half thousand for the for the surgery. She'd have to keep it very quiet. So that was five thousand dollars all up. And she explained to me. She said, "Look, I'm a single mum rearing three children, have a house mortgage." Um, she said, "This might sound callous, but it would be cheaper for me to put the dog down than than uh, than go ahead with this uh, this treatment, which I can't afford." So I said, look, if you can bring the dog up here, we'll have a look at it. And her father lives up here. And I said, if you could leave it with your dad and um, and we could uh, treat it on a daily basis um, and see how we go. So um, they brought the dog round. It was dragging itself along the ground. It couldn't walk at all. Um, we gave it a treatment and um, brought it back the next day. Um, the dog was getting around a little better, but not didn't show much improvement. Gave it a second treatment and come back the next day. It was walking on all fours, but it was a bit sway in the back end and um, gave it another treatment. And they brought it back the next day and um, her father told me, he said, you know what I'd done this morning? It jumped up on the lounge chair. I said, oh, that, was, that was something. Uh, gave it another treatment, brought it back the next day. He said, you wouldn't know what happened this morning. I said, no. He said, it chased the postman down the driveway this morning. And uh, after about five treatments, the dog was uh, was up and running around uh, without without the need of surgery. And uh, and that, that couldn't have been done without the, uh, without the pulsar. 